Inside drive to right. Takes a three. Touchdown, 49ers. Hurry! All right, Larry Kruger here in the studio talking 49er football. Niners making another move this week. Elvis Doomerville at 33 is the latest 49er. Now, this is a guy who played with John Lynch. He's a tough guy. This is a guy who played most of 2015 with a 60% torn Achilles. And he played the full 16-game schedule because his team needed him, and there were a bunch of guys hurt on his defense. So we know Elvis Doomerville is committed to play. This was a guy who was told at Louisville, despite the fact that he was the Big East Player of the Year in college at Louisville, that he couldn't play in the NFL because he was too short. Six feet, 255, he can bend the edge. Now, are they getting Elvis Doomerville from a few years ago, 2009, when he led the NFL in sacks? No. But what you are getting is probably a guy who you know is going to give you your, his best and a guy who they can use in a rotation at the Leo spot. Eric Armstead, a little big as far as you know, play that spot on a regular basis. He's number one on the depth chart on the, at the Leo spot at the OTAs. But I think what you're going to see with Robert Sala's defense, Jeff Ganina, the D-line coach, made the point this week. He likes to rotate guys, give me four or five really good plays, and then I'll get you off the field. You're going to see a rotation of guys, Ronald Blair, Tank Carradine, Buckner, Armstead. Um, and now, of course, you're going to get uh, an undersized pass rusher, Elvis Doomerville, who I think still has a little left in the tank. So for the 49ers, it gives their defense a little teeth. They were 19th in the NFL last year in, in sacks. They have to develop a little pass rush. I think it stands up to be a very deep and talented defensive front. It's going to be really interesting to see how they rotate their guys.